Hey everyone, really interesting question I got asked the other day. How do I get myself into this ideal day and week? Well, I'm not sure about you, but ideal days and weeks went about like years ago. To me, it's about the daily designer. And daily designer is about getting yourself into a bit of a weekly and daily workflow. Because if you're able to master this, you're going to be able to conquer and get yourself into what we call the zone of being in peak flow. The best way to do it is keep it simple, not complex. So what do I mean? Like I just see so many people like, you know, between 9 and 9.30, I'm checking emails. Between 9.30 and 10, I'm returning calls. Between 10 and 10.45, I'm doing a call session. Great little chunks can just be making it too complex, right? It's almost like you're feeling like you're being micromanaged. Break it up into four parts. Super simple, and it'll get you into peak flow. Number one, how do you start your day? The moment you roll your way out of bed, what do you actually do? Like to get a bit of dopamine hitting the brain, a bit of the endorphins running, because as you know, and I know, sales is all about energy, yeah? So are you like hitting that snooze button and sleeping in, or some days you're getting up and doing things and you're not? To me, a routine is about how you're gonna amplify that morning. So amplify your day, whatever it may look like, going for a walk possibly. For me these days, it's like jumping in the ocean, just feels so invigorating, getting a bit of salt water. It's gonna get a little bit chilly as we head into winter, but I don't mind. I don't mind getting that little bit of a cold sort of snap and shock into my system. But I'm looking at amplifying the day because that shifts and changes my state immediately. Second part of your day is all about generate. What appointments can I generate for today and for the rest of the week? So generate should look like, what phone calls am I making, yeah? Who could I be looking in my pipeline to book in for a listing appointment? What type of you know, uh, uh, database calls can I be ringing to create market appraisals and, and convert some of those into generate some market appraisals for this week? Third thing might be is, who could I be calling to in my buyer hot list to uh, generate a buyer appointment for this afternoon or this week. So second thing you gotta think about is generate. Third one is what I call convert. Hey guys, that's where all the money's made, right? Conversion. So the afternoons is all about converting a listing appointment to a listing, converting you know, a, a market appraisal to a pipeline seller, converting that buyer appointment to an offer and getting it sold. So afternoons is all about who are you gonna be converting? Final part of the day, you know what, we need to fill our cup and a little bit of our thing that's called the soul. And I really like to reach into things that are able to rejuvenate me. Now, I'm not thinking about you and I going a little bit, doo -doo, a bit like, you know, doing a bit of Yoda. Um, Yoda, did I say? Yoga, <laughs> not Yoda, even though I love Star Wars. But really thinking about how you rejuvenate. For me, sometimes it's just watching a bit something on Netflix. It could be, I don't know, watching uh, something that's just going to like sort of make, make me chill. Uh, sometimes, you know, it's picking up a book and reading at the end of the day. Sometimes it could be a little bit of journaling at the end of the, at the end of the day, but just like in the evenings and so forth, or just sometimes it's hanging out with your kids. But what are some of the things that you're doing to rejuvenate? So four parts of your day. Number one, how you're going to start your day is all about Amplify. Sales is an energy game and it's transient and people buy it every day from you. Secondly, what are you doing to generate appointments? If you're not going on appointments, man, you know what? You're not going to have a business. Three, what are you doing in the afternoons to convert? Converting listing appointment to listings, basically a buyer appointment to getting an offer. And the fourth way, what are you doing to sort of like chill out and zone out and rejuvenate? Stick to those four parts of your day and you'll get yourself into what I call peak flow.